Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. We, of course, greet um, the Honorable President of Medina Institute, Sheikh Minawi, our Honorable Guest, the Honorable Bilal Ertogan, Sheikh Fatih um, Effendi, as well as the MJC's uh, representative, Sheikh Riyad Bittar, all of our Mashaya uh, that is here with us today, Sheikh Hanif Muad, our Honorable Trustees that are here today, as well as the many guests that have come and the many wonderful relations that we share within the community and across the world. We also say assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh to everyone that is tuned in with us, sharing this momentous occasion, the 10th graduation of Medina Institute, alhamdulillah. To all of our parents that were also wanting to be here but are watching from abroad, the many families that are celebrating the sacrifices and the wins of our students today. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Indeed, it is an honor and a pleasure to be standing here today in this historical venue, a venue that, like our Sheikh had touched on, where people seek solutions and they seek ways to making things better for everyone living right here in Cape Town. And I think had it been 11 years ago, we would never have thought that there would be an institute right here graduating as many as the graduates we have over these 10 years. Many people come <laughs> and many people go, but the reality for us at Medina is they go a bit differently into the world. From the very first day to the very last day, there is continuous change. And as we have seen that COVID had changed a lot for us, and we didn't quite have the graduation right here, but a lot more has changed. The world has changed, but the mission remains the same. We have seen Medina Institute grow from the Asul al Din program to now be graduating the foundations in Islamic studies, as well as our third lot of Bachelor of Arts students, and that is making history right here in Cape Town. From the Gada Jones of Cape Town, where many of us had learned the Dean to stopping to stand at five, we have now excelled to taking this knowledge much further. And it is very important for us to continue keeping this as accessible as possible, not only locally, but abroad. And so, in terms of gratitude, we are, of course, firstly and foremost, as Medina Institute directs each and every one of us, is to be thankful to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, to consistently be thankful to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. And in many of our days at Medina, we find ourselves in different instances and many different lessons. And in those, we understand more about gratitude and we understand more about Allah and we understand more about our purpose towards Him and our purpose right here. And so today we are very proud of our graduates, mashallah, and we are very proud of our educators, our academic department. And I'm going to ask them just to rise for a minute, all of our lecturers. And I would like us to honor them for spending the bulk of their days and nights in educating our students with the best of Dean. We are not the only that make sure that everything goes on at Medina Institute. We have an awesome administrative team, an awesome operations team, but mostly we have trustees and our president that have entrusted us to maintain a family at Medina Institute. So the growth in Elam is not only with our students, but we are all students consistently. We take this opportunity to be grateful to our trustees who excel extensively in keeping our doors open and in keeping this degree as accessible as possible to as many as possible. 
The world needs the knowledge that we are imparting from Medina Institute. More so, those relations have grown much bigger in the community with many organizations such as OCAF, and we also would like to congratulate the new CEO of OCAF, and that is our brother Mikhail. Well done. We also have many more relations such as SANZAF and Fusion in Yameko, Aspire, and many more like Warriors of Hope, and our students have grown significantly in what Medina Institute prioritizes as HIDMA. And HIDMA is a big, big thing in which the practices of understanding gratitude is extended. When it comes to prayer, there is so much more to be thankful for. And at Medina Institute, we understand that prayer includes the good times and the difficult times. We also understand that every knowledge we acquire is not one to sit in our books or on our lips, but to be invested in our hearts and to be transcended through our actions and our character. And hence, it is so proud for us to be able to see students walk into Medina and when they walk out at the same day, there is change and there is growth. And we are confidently seeing that annually over the 10 years. We have seen madrasas open in areas that never had madrasas before. We are seeing classes and we are seeing many of them taking leadership positions in many areas unexpected. But also I'd like to mention our dear dean, our Professor Malloy, who has since the start with Medina Institute influenced us in the area of research, which we have definitely developed on over this past few years. In this year, we have seen ourselves excel in extending a research module to all in our BA, in our BA degree, and we've also seen that extension excel amongst our lecturers. If we can please have a hand of applause for them. In our example set by the Dean, who is consistently producing papers, Alhamdulillah, we look forward to Medina Institute excelling in extending the research and collaborations with many others, inshallah. We also need to say that that is what we are also grateful for, the many relationships that we see in this room, the many that were in this position before me, the many that have molded and worked towards the growth of Medina Institute before, and the many that will still come. We take the opportunity also to thank the many friends that we have, whether it is in government or whether it is in the private sector, that we really constantly gravitate towards supporting the mission of Medina Institute. And the mission is one that shall bring solutions to the many difficulties and challenges we have to the model fiber that we find within our communities. On that note, we note also that this is a big year and we look forward to another big team, inshallah, we thank our, our guests for gifting us with the wonderful gifts um, all the way from Turkey and the many of you that are present here. Because as you sit here, you sit here as ambassadors of this team that will continue the message leaving these chambers that Medina Institute is the place where we may grow closer towards Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, where we may truly understand our purpose, where we will understand gratitude and definitely deliver upon it. I thank you for the opportunity.